Yo, yo! What's up, guys? Welcome to the bus. I'm Marky Basie. We're uh, currently on the PMD tour, supporting my new album that came out uh, at the end of last year. This is uh, our above, our humble above, for uh, six weeks. Second tour with pretty much the same crew. I like to keep a solid uh, team around, people I trust, people that trust each other, so we've got a good vibe. If I'm being really honest, there's not that much, um, like everyone's just in their bunk on their phone, watching Netflix. Like, we have sports on. Um, we got a lot of sports fans on the bus. I'm a big basketball fan. Um, from the Bay Area, San Francisco, so I'm a big Warrior fan. Um, but my favorite player in the NBA plays uh, for the Bulls. Um, but anyways, it's a different story. Um, so yeah, we usually have like a game on. Um, sometimes I bet. We play music really loud till like six in the morning, like a normal tour bus. Um, it's really loud. Dumping in here, got some subs that are under this chair right here. In drawers, let's see, a lot of water. Very important to stay hydrated when you uh, live a life on the edge, so to speak, like you do on tour. It's very important. One downside to having to stay hydrated is this single-use plastic. And I told uh, my tour manager, Rachel, I wanted to be rid of single-use plastic on this tour. And she was like, no, you don't, Mark, because you're going to drink the most bottles of water. Um, and it's true, so I'm sorry. Um, people that uh, police over shit like that if you have a a way in which you could help us out I would appreciate it and I would ditch this but I don't know what I would do I guess I could just like have more self-discipline it's probably, probably not impossible uh, vitamins another health drawer big CBD fans melatonin you know omega-3 is very important for uh, vitality this is a, I've never seen this drawer in my life. <laughs> uh, let's see, over here. Anything interesting in here? Nice, some shoes. You know, you make all these fucking rules and ideas when you first get on the tour bus and then once you're halfway through, uh, a lot of that goes out the window. Fridges, one important uh, distinction between a tour bus fridge and a regular fridge is this little latch uh, thing right here. Always needs to be on because otherwise the food will fly out in the middle of the night. Tour bus, it's like shakes and rocks more than you would assume. It gets, it gets uh, freaky. I'm Marky Basie. This is the Marky Basie tour bus, so I don't even have to worry about this fridge. I've never even looked in this. It looks pretty gross. I see a lot of pepperoni. Not just the pepperoni pizza, but there's literally two things of pepperoni. That's pretty gross. Uh, <laughs> there's some rose. Maybe we should have one of these. This looks, you know, I'm bougie. I have a, a refined palette from San Francisco, California. They make us bratty and sophisticated. So let's see if this passes the smell test. It's watermelon rosé, which is gross uh, immediately, so. <laughs> Did we like get this for free or something? Sorry. I'm a great sponsor. <laughs> Brands, please come. That's horrific. Oh my god. That's really gross. You know when you're like hungover and like your your taste buds are more sensitive? It's like I need it, but it's not a glowing endorsement. Uh, this is Gianni and Kyle who are on tour with me. And they have great uh, avid cultish fans who know that uh, Kyle in particular is very fond of Doritos. And so we get lots of bags from, we get gifted Doritos. And, uh, and then I end up like forgetting to eat and then I just like slam a whole bag of these terrible dietary situation on this bus. Um, they even made this, some fans made this for Gianni and Kyle. They're my dogs, they're my little bros, I like them a lot, they're great. Um, this is the quote board. Um, Another thing, like it used to say something new and insightful and inspiring every day. Uh, now it says, would you be there when I'm shiny? Um, which is a uh, joke about a flaccid small penis. 
Don't ever have. Popsicles. These things are a big hit on the bus. These things go crazy. I don't care what anyone says. Tortinos, you guys are good with me. I eat really healthy when I'm home. I shop at this grocery store called Erwan. I always joke that it costs more money my groceries do than my rent. Um, but once I once I get on the road, it's more about conserving your energy, and not overeating. But like when it's like four in the morning, these things are crazy. I'm rushing Tito's. I love you guys. They supply us with vodka. I always have a box of Tito's. This is just like some storage. Keep my coats down here. Which leads us to the in tour bus life. Bunk space is very important. Like when I was first starting out, this was my bunk. And I couldn't be anywhere else. I have to be on top. Some people like the middle. Some people even like to be on the bottom. In the little coffins, we call them in the bottom. I like uh, being on top. I don't know if it's like an ego trip or a pride or something. But I also, like when I was growing up, I liked the top bunk. I had a bunk bed. Um, this is a very full bus. Um, not only we're on tour with me and my crew, but also the openers, Gianni and Kyle, which is, uh, if they weren't such good guys, it would be really annoying, because usually you have like two junk bunks where people just throw their shit. But I've uh, reached some level of success now where I get the whole back room to myself. This is uh, like turned into my little sanctuary. As you can see, someone came in and made my bed right before you got here to make it look like I have my shit together. Make, I set up my studio back here. I make music, watch watch TV. Just kind of like hang out with myself, really. Fuck around. I go to the gym. Got my uh, my pre-workout and my uh, content. Very important for muscle building. <laughs> but yeah, it's like really, I like it back here. They have like, Obviously a lot of levels of tour buses. This is kind of like on the lower mid tier. I've had like started out like, obviously I did, I toured in like a minivan. Then all of the, the iterations um, that you can do, except like the next step is like a big ass, they call it a star bus, where you have like a, a big, uh, big ass like bedroom essentially in the back of the bus. So I'm looking forward to that, but this has been major major upgrade um, so it's kind of nice I like to give myself um, reminders that I'm uh, progressing and this little room is kind of like a nice progression in my life there's the emergency exit <laughs> in case everyone gets coronavirus if I can see this custom jacket this guy just made me this custom jacket Pretty fire. This is a cool. I just sang the national anthem at the uh, Knicks game. I said I'm a basketball fan, I'm a Warrior fan, but this is pretty cool. They made me wear this, and now this is like my good luck charm. This Knicks scarf. Never thought I would say that. I need to wash it though. But. So yeah, appreciate you guys uh, coming through. PMD's out right now. We uh, have new music coming soon. We're on tour uh, for another month, and we're gonna be doing the festival circuit this summer. If coronavirus has a shutdown on music festivals, <laughs> thanks for hanging out. Check me out on Instagram everywhere that you can uh, see artist Marky Basie, and get out of here. I gotta get ready. For my show tonight. Appreciate y'all.